Hey there, fishing girl. We are in Brunswick, Georgia right now, using a brand new camera that I just am in the middle of purchasing. Uh, it's got better stabilization, super excited about it. We are here in Georgia for the Running of the Bulls tournament with the Kids Can Fish Foundation. I'm super pumped to be here. Got some friends here. Right behind me, you'll see the sinker guy, Chip Brunage. We're in Brunswick, but the tournament's gonna be taking place on St. Simon's Island. So we're gonna be heading over there tomorrow morning, but let me turn you around here. We've got registration going on. They're doing some raffles over there in the corner. We've got all these items here that they're gonna be raffling off for the charity, but just a fun, fun event. Can't wait to fish tomorrow. This whole tournament is about catching redfish. Biggest redfish. They're gonna have a prize for the smallest one. I may end up catching that one. Who knows? But anyways, I cannot wait. We'll see you on the beach tomorrow. We're gonna pick back up with this at the tournament tomorrow. We'll see you. Well, good morning, fishing girl. We are out here, St. Simon's Island. It's like a little after six in the morning. It is pitch black. Um, I'm going to put my headlamp on, we're going to get my beach cart out to the beach and uh, go find my friend Justin and we're going to try to get set up and get ready for 8 o'clock lines in the water. We'll see you out there. Check out that sunrise, it is beautiful. So looking around here, that over there is Jekyll Island. All of that in the distance there. Got a bunch of people down there, <laughs> all filming the sunrise. It's beautiful. All right, we are just a few minutes from go time. We've got an amazing sunset here this morning. Got my friend Justin down here fishing. And we have empty beach. I'm gonna turn you around. We've got emptiness like right next to us. I can't believe there's like 177 people signed up for this tournament and we have all this empty space next to it. It's awesome. So I'm setting up this camera on the tripod. This is the older camera. I'm gonna put the newer camera on my chest so we got dual things going here. It's gonna be awesome. It's eight o'clock, so we're gonna ready to throw lines in the water. I've been charging my camera. Charged as it can be. So I've got the uh, lady dagger here. I'm gonna really toss this out. All right, you got your GoPro on. You're gonna win the whole damn thing. I'm gonna try. This is gonna be my far out rod. Let's see what we can do here. So that has got a fish finder rig on it with a whiting head. This. This is Pen Pursuit 4. Big old, big old reel. And this has got um, some cut mullet with those crab strips that I got from Fish Bites. Something tugged on this. I just tugged it though, it didn't, didn't take it. Oh, this guy just caught a little shark. Got some sharks out there. All right, so I left that on way too long. I'm gonna have to charge my camera again soon. I just have one battery. <laughs> but people down there are walking this out to the sandbar and throwing it from there. So I'm gonna do that too. I'm just gonna walk it out to the sandbar. All right, so we got the tide going out. I'm moving my lines closer. We're gonna move camera. We're gonna move cart. We're gonna move everything closer. Okay, I'm gonna start reeling this because there might be something here. Yay! Do I get an award for the stupidest thing caught? My uh, better camera overheated, so it's sitting in the cooler right now. Cool down. It's officially party time on the sandbar. Look at all those people fishing that way. All those people fishing that way. <laughs> it's awesome. Check out this blue crab. Hang on. He just went into where I... I really want this crab. I don't want to get pinched. 
<laughs> oh, you're such good bait, though. Come here, Mr. Crab. <laughs> oh, my gosh. No, oh, no, he's alive. He's trying to pinch me. <laughs> he's mad. He could hurt you though, because he's got big claws. See him? Yeah. He's a big up crab. Yesterday, but I picked it up on its back so it couldn't pinch me. Okay. Ouch, he got me. <laughs> I've uh, on the side of my he I got its cracks, so there's like holes. <laughs> If I get distracted enough, <laughs> I really want this crab. Come on, dude. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm actually going to break his claws off so he can't get me. <laughs> Do you like the claw meat? I don't know. Can I have the claw? <laughs> sure. You can have both of them. Ow. <laughs> He's trying to get me. Ah, oh, you made oh, my day. Luck, yeah. <laughs> get something big. Oh yeah, I hope so too. <laughs> We're gonna take this oh, guy and cut him up. Oh, All right, I got no lines in the water. I had a knot that unraveled and went for the crab that I just found that I cut up. And that is gone. And my sinker. <laughs> So, and then that one's all tangled up. So I've got to untangle that, but I'm gonna fix this and get it out. It's been really slow. I'm heading, uh, I rebaited this with this blue crab again. Something had pretty much eaten off the other crab that I had and nothing touched the mullet head. So I'm gonna try it again. What's that? So there's a guy out there snorkeling like directly in front of where my line's at. Both of them. That one's going in, that one's going in. Whatever's nibbling that stopped, of course. Surprise, surprise. So I just caught a little whiting and he's gonna be bait. Who wouldn't, who knew? I just put my regular pompano rig on. I was like, you know what? People catch redfish on all kind of setups. So now I got bait. So this is not just any old whiting. This is a northern kingfish. I thought I was southern. Look at all the stripes. No, northern. Also should have some teeth. Yeah, he's got some little teeth. So I didn't expect another whiting. This one's a, uh... yeah, see those stripes on him? Sweet. Yeah, I think they're both northern. They got really distinctive stripes when you look in the, in the water at them when they get to the surface here. Okay, we got Mr. Northern Kingfish. These swim, revive a little bit. Okay, okay. Let's go, dude. Alright, so it's about o'clock, a little after 2 o'clock on Saturday. Someone said that the tide might turn around around 3. In the meantime, I've just been putting uh, double drop rigs out there with glass beads, fish bites, and salted shrimp, and I've been catching whiting for bait. So they're the perfect bait size. They're, they're kind of small. I'll, uh, I'll show you what I want to see. Justin's got one in here too. But uh, yeah. So we're getting our bait fish ready, um, the bigger one. He's, they've been in there. I've got my bubbler going, but they're starting to die, but hopefully the redfish will want them when they come around close to the beach and we've got them out there. I've got one on this rod and I've got my salted shrimp and uh, fish bites and glass beads over there, waiting for that to get hit again with another bait fish. So we keep trying. So this little whiting, I mean, he's been out of the water for a minute, but he was still alive when I came pulled him out. I'm gonna get him back out there even farther. So it's about 3.20. Got just about an hour, maybe a little bit more left of the tournament today. Got all day tomorrow, but 
have to admit, I'm tired. I uh, could not sleep well last night. I'm so excited to, to fish today. So, yeah. Still nothing happening. Not seeing anybody else catching anything right now. So, we'll just keep waiting. Got a stingray. Fun, fun. This little tiny one, too. Looks like the same one Justin caught a little while ago. Well, it's something other than whiting, I guess. I just like to step on them, so. Dude, go. No, this is not where you want to be. I guess it is where he wants to be. We only got 10 minutes left, so I'm gonna reel in whatever is going on. And it's not. Oh, something. <laughs> well, something bit it off. Something bit it off. <laughs> Look at that chomp bite. Tax man. Well, we're all packed up for the day. I didn't catch any redfish. I caught a bunch of whiting, caught a stingray. I caught that blue crab, <laughs> was able to use that for bait. So, I mean, it was still fun. Got to fish with, got to meet some new friends and uh, fish with some people I never get to fish with before. So um, today was fun, but I'm looking forward to tomorrow. Hopefully getting on some redfish. So until tomorrow, we'll see ya. Good morning, fishing girl. We are on day two of the tournament. Hoping to get on some redfish today. We got the sunrise behind me. And check out this huge ship. So cool. And we are stacked up. Look at all. Boom, boom, boom. All the way down. And we got a bunch of people. We got some new friends here that I'm fishing with today. And as soon as this tide goes out, it's gonna, we're going to be able to come right around this corner. And I've heard there's deeper water out here. So I cannot wait. It's going to be so much fun. Day two of the tournament, hoping to get on a big redfish. Okay, we are like one minute away from lines out in the water. This huge boat is coming across. It's so cool. I'm getting ready to walk out, walk my bait out. We've got the sun coming up. I just met with the director, Tom. He's taking a picture. Woo! Just in time. <laughs> Holes in the water. Oh yeah. Here we go. I'm just gonna record this. Ducks flying up there. I'm gonna go ahead and cast from here. That's so awesome. I love this. That was a great cast. That was awesome. Casting the Lady Dagger. Ninja Tackle. Straight ahead. All right, not too shabby. I'm pretty sure it's just a whiting, but I'll take it. Fresh, live bait, if possible. I hope it's still on. They keep popping off. I don't know if it's maybe my hooks aren't as sharp as they used to be or what. Oh yeah, I think it's still on. Yeah, it's still on. Got bait. That's a pretty good whiting. Come on, dude. Chill out. So. It's not a golf. Might be a southern. 
Look in his mouth, do you see any teeth? There we go, or slack. In my neck of the woods, I would think I had a pompano, but not here. Somebody caught a pompano here yesterday, which is really weird for here. The water is very dirty, so they must have found a pocket of clean water or something. Hopefully this is another bait fish. Put it out there. Nope, we lost it. Okay, got another whiting. Something. <laughs> this feels bigger. Hopefully. <laughs> not a stingray or a shark. Better not be a catfish. I don't think they have too many catfish here. This definitely feels heavier though. Please be a redfish. Please be even a baby redfish. Please, please, please. Don't come off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I got a pompano. Woo! <laughs> Yeah, let me get a picture. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> That's dinner. Yeah, it sure is. Look at that beautiful pompano. What were you guys saying about not having? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess you do on fish bites. Fish bites and sinker by sinker guy hey, beads. Fish and grill, catch a jacket. <laughs> <laughs> hey, get in here. Get a picture. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, cool. Oh, That's man. a decent one. This is awesome. Hey! Does anybody know the limit for Georgia on Pompano? You, know, you know, you just got a $200 fish wear or that marsh wear thing. Say what? You're really? the first one to catch anything in the adults. I think it's red fish. I've, I don't think it's red fish. I've been catching hey, whiting all day yesterday and today. Hey, Sweet. I know it's 11 to the fork in Florida, but I don't know what it is in Georgia. Okay, we got... Yeah, we got right at 12. So... Is that a keeper? Get in Georgia? I don't know. We're trying to find out. All us... Are you all from Florida? No, we're too? from right here in Brunswick. Oh, right. <laughs> That's why I came running down here. We don't catch those here. It's rare. Not off the beach. Not off the beach. Dude. Bro, okay. chill. Yeah, I know. It's Either A, you're going in the cooler, or B, you're going back in the water. He's 12. 11. He's 12 to the fork. I, mean, I yeah. know Florida's 11, but... Yeah, see, we get the law. Georgia, 11 or 10? No, nobody knows. 12 to the fork. It's 12. I mean, he's, let me measure again, because he's like just barely 12. I was about to say. So. Let you mind. Yeah, somebody got a uh, meat tenderizer? All right, you're coming home with me. All right, man. Sweet. That's some good awesome, right yeah. Here. Dude. <laughs> yeah, like my camera. Just dancing. Sweet. Nice. I caught a fish that you guys don't catch no. too often. Yeah. Somebody caught one yesterday too. Who was yeah, who caught one? Tail too. Yeah. I you saw that. Triple I was tail. like triple tail. What the heck? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> He's flipping all my ice. <laughs> this first one I've been close enough to film. So my new friend here just got a redfish. Check that thing out. Oh, that's beautiful. Rolling. <laughs> Man, that's beautiful. He's a golden color too. This one probably came out of the river. Yeah. 
Yep. I need someone to write that down. Someone take a picture. 36 inches. Man, that's beautiful. Two spots. 36 inches, two spots. You're going to lift this up. You're going to get a picture. Yeah. All right. I need you to get a picture. I'm holding yep. it. Make sure you got a picture. Right now. Yeah, make sure you got a picture. That's awesome. 36 inches. Beautiful. Yeah, no, make sure before he gets a go. Sierra, get another one. Ah. Like for its queen. <laughs> Nice That's one, awesome, man. man. Beautiful. Nice one, man. So that other redfish was caught on a whiting head. So I have Perry Nice head a little closer. Nice little whiting head. I'm going to walk this out as far as I can get it. Try to hit the deep water. The tide's starting to go out, so we should be able to move everything out pretty soon. I'm going to move this line out to the sandbar because I've got kids messing with my stuff. I'm going to at least get, I don't know what's going on with this. It must have really drifted. Day two of the tournament. We've had some fun already. I caught a pompano in Georgia, St. Simons Island. I guess they don't catch many pompano here because people keep coming down to look at it. They're so astounded. But anyways... I haven't caught a redfish yet. A few other people have caught a couple, but we've got some stuff out in the water. We're waiting, but the tide's going out, so we're gonna keep moving out with the tide. We've got some deeper waters here. Let me spin you around and show you what it looks like. Look at all those people fishing down there. <laughs> we've seen so many people fishing at once. It's pretty awesome. There's my buddy, Justin, fishing out here together the tournament we got Andy back here <laughs> he's a judge wave to the camera Andy <laughs> he's taking a nap <laughs> so we're just gonna we're gonna keep this rolling and that way if anything interesting happens we're gonna catch it right on film Gonna get a bonnet head kiss. Something's wrong with a file that I just tried to record. Hopefully not all of my files from earlier. But we've got this, uh, got my lady dagger hooked up with a mullet. And then I've got the Akuma rod with a live baby whiting on it. I'm gonna get my other camera back on. It's up, should be fully charged now. So we got two and a half hours left of the tournament. So I think I have enough battery power with that one battery to cover the rest of the tournament. Hoping for a redfish. goes. Woo! Woo! That's awesome. 
Okay, so I'm resorting to standing in the water because my legs are burning and Andy's asleep using my towel that I brought to cover my legs because I knew they would get hot. And since I can't use that, I stand in the water. So something bit off the entire mullet, left the head and the hook. Jeez, why does this fish have to be so smart? Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's lighting. There's a starfish stuck to his head. <laughs> I'm dying. This is hilarious. <laughs> Well, he was alive. <laughs> what? This was the live whiting that I put out. And a star no <laughs> starfish. Yes, it's stuck on my whiting. Oh my, God. oh my lord. <laughs> what? <laughs> Well, he was alive until Mr. Starfish suffocated him to death. Dude, stay away from my fish. That's awesome. Wow. Look at that thing. Hey. <laughs> 39 and a half. 39 and a half. Wow. Yes, yeah, on the adult division, yes. Sorry, baby. Woo! How many spots? One, two, three, four. On the tail? This one is there touching the camera. Okay, cool. Four, five, six, seven. Eight. Eight. Hold on. A little tiny one, but still. Nine. Okay. Yeah. You guys good with that? Woo! Woo! Yeah. Time is Man, that's beautiful. Did you guys get that? Yes, I did. Okay, so we don't pick something. Oh, that's awesome. Alright. Yeah. That was fast. Yeah! 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 Oh man, he's out there like right next to my lines. <laughs> Why couldn't have been moving? Oh well. Oh, you're good, my, my lines are both kind of that direction. I just made the judge feel. I said, I don't want to knock you out of first. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, we got a shark. Not a redfish. Well, Packing up to go home. We uh, didn't catch a redfish, but we were able to catch a pompano, a bunch of whiting, stingray, sharks, um, all kinds of stuff. So we're gonna be heading home. It's been a fun tournament. If you like this content, push the like, push that subscribe, hit the notification bell so you get notified every time I go live, every time I post a new video. And as always, tight lines, God bless, and we'll see you, fishing girl.